came to me with the choreography uh, role. We kind of, uh, first we started fresh without looking at anything else and we just talked about uh, the songs of the show. And the first thing we said that we both agreed on was the variety aspect. It definitely has to have variety. It's not, it can't be just the same rock and roll, the same songs, the same style of genre of songs. It has to be slow songs, it has to be fast songs. Uh, we have to have medium paced songs and it's got to break it up all the time. It can't just be the same. People get bored watching the same thing for too long. So that was the first thing we agreed on. Then we looked at the choreography that they had before for the last, last show, um, which was like 10 years ago. And, you know, times have changed um, compared to what people expect today. So we said, you know, we really need to modernize it. You know, we had to, we can't just use rock and roll dancing. It's far beyond the stars, it's near beyond the moon. I know beyond a doubt, my heart would lead me there soon. Obviously, with the 50s, it comes with a lot of rock and roll, a lot of jive, and things like that, uh, jitterbug, but also, we actually bring a lot of different flavors to the show as well. You see a little bit of ballroom, you see a little bit of cha-cha, you see a little bit of jazz. So we just try to look at the era and all the different things that were present and try to represent as much flavor um, as possible. With this show, we have a lot of energy on stage, pretty much like 95% of the time, so it's fun. <laughs>